this family they're riding back to the hotel. We literally just left the, the port uh, that takes you to Gory Island. Uh, so we just literally left um, the car, ferry boat uh, station. And I'm just showing you, uh, this a nice view of this beautiful uh, city in the car. So what we're also looking at is also the coast. It's a country with an incredible coastline. And earlier today, I saw a nice little you know, beach area where you can actually go and work out. Last time I remember seeing that was when I was in Brazil. But this was a lot more impressive because there was so much stations. Like this, that's, what, that's for the children right there. More for the children. Abdu, this is real nice, man. I like this. You got basketball court. Western Cornish. Yeah, like honestly, this is this reminds me of where I, where I stayed at in the Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. They had the same setup, but this is a little, you know, this is a little smaller, but uh, it's also a little nicer because you have more workout station. And then there you go, family, children on the beach, playing soccer, chilling, enjoying, running. This is an incredible. That's a big police uh, military vehicle. Are they expecting an invasion or something? Yes, the, the university is on the other side, you know. All the strikes. Oh, the protests, I got you, yeah. Yeah. So they got the, they got, they, they got the riot gear ready. Yeah. It's only been about three weeks since the last year. That's another area right here, family. Um, you know, um, we have to create as much activity and things for uh, children and you know, and the grown children and the you know, people in general uh, as far as activities. Uh, but seriously, I'll do. This is nice, man. This is nice. It, it gives people um, the opportunity to do. More, more calisthenics and more natural exercise yeah. um, without weightlifting, which is you know, also fine, but this is just being out in nature. Yeah, this gave me a great idea in, 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 uh, in our community in Ghana. Yeah, the, yeah, and that's what I tell people, you travel around the world, you come up with so much great ideas that you can invest in your own operation. Yeah, like some of the things I got from this uh, being in different parts of Jamaica, like the Grill, Ocherias, Montego Bay. It, you're like, okay, well, this is the beach area also. What can we, you know, how can we accomplish this and make it like a straight black enterprise? You know, have our own, you know, Miami and uh, and Panama City Beach type type setup. So who want to go gambling with me later on? There's a casino right there. <laughs> Is that the mall you're talking about, huh? Yeah. So perfect. You, so you saw it. You happy now? I went up to see. They didn't go experience. I see it before. This is Sonika family. You may remember her from our wonderful Ghana December 2019 journey. She keeps, right so when we talk about the land, she know what land we're talking about because she saw it in a raw stage. Now people are building houses on there now. I have the pictures. Now, I was just looking. I was just telling her that, oh wow, these are the pictures from you from the land. There we go, like literally when I go back next time you're gonna see a few houses up. One person almost got you know, they got the walls coming up. It'll be like a synagogue. And all it is it takes one person. You know? One brave soul and then once they get that going, and I got several other people on standby. So family, you know, these ideas is to But the good thing about it, the mall is close, as you can see. Why is it close? It's close, it's nearby. Uh, the, the hotel is just right around the, right around the area. Oh yeah, exactly, uh, Pink Lake uh, 4x4 journey. 
and then uh, shopping at uh, Thai's if that fine. works out. That's nice. So that's what I remember now. Uh, if anyone wants to shop, we had, a, we had half a day tomorrow just, uh, for full shopping. You know, um, I got you when we finish this. Uh, just organize it. Um, I'll get it from you later. But thanks for writing it down. So that's the family. The journey of a lifetime continues. And Itself, even showing you that you know that there are literally roads in the country because sometimes some, some of our folks is crazy. They're like, Why am I going to Africa? There's no this. I was like, How do you know I? Who lied to you? You know, so family, if you want to know more about what's going on in Africa, people like myself, I document everything. You know, we do show a nicer part of everything, but that's not like blindfolding you because you know, when people t tell you about America, they don't tell you about all the crackheads and all the crazy ass people. And all of the, you know, the worst of the things. Mm -hmm. But I feel like it's unfair when we talk about Africa. We, we tend to just want to focus on one or two things, and and also not even looking at the fact that most of the countries that we have established in Africa is you know, several decades old, and that's under neo-colonialism. Yeah. And so it's uh, it's you know, we have to just put things in proper perspective, family. So. Join the journey of a lifetime and experience Africa and what we talked about earlier is the land that we have in Ghana to build a community and connect ourselves better with the people and be able to put our money together better with the rest of our people. It's not to separate ourselves because I don't know idea how people get that stuff from you know? oh, yeah. everyone on around the land that we live at is all or the land that we're gonna be living on is all Ghanaians. And we have a few Ghanaians in our group and we'll get a few more. But um, I'm a tactical strategic person. So when people say you guys go to Africa to divide yourself or go to Africa to do this and that, like don't tell us how, what to do because obviously, you know, if we keep doing the same thing, it's not gonna work. We have to look at innovative way. And so innovation for me is always gonna be group economics. Connecting with us with light mind energy. So what you're looking at family is the African Renaissance monument. And this may be a little bright, uh, but we're gonna give you another angle from here. Uh, and actually we position us roll curve into again. ridiculous amount of white folks so I'm telling you don't let folks lie to you and tell you this and then they're not doing the same because if they were really if all the things that, that uh, you know, European white folks whatever you want to call it said about Africa was true they wouldn't be here enjoying the best of the country and you know, whenever you go anywhere you can see local people don't bother them and those of us that's coming from the dance so we definitely don't have no time for them so they're here chilling and doing what they need to do so we just gotta you know, be real about what we're building. So, family, we're gonna do a lot of beautiful things in Africa. We're gonna have all of our own professional leagues outside of these other folks in Europe. They just always want to share it, you know, share with us what they have. That way, they can capitalize and dominate us. Hello? Hello? 
chose this era because you can this every time you see this you're like wow <laughs> yes wow this is us yeah ah man my nini bini man my nini bini my nini bini wow my nini bini wow ah man parcel 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 Boy, boy, them cars, but I with what I with what? Costello, Costello. Here we are, yeah. home sweet home. Can you do a new wow? Many new ones. Many wow. new ones. You go family, and you know we do it, sir. Huh? Supporting black on enterprise. Yes, thank you. The one thank is you. supposed to be on my what the Arabs, but you can see it's maybe a little fancier. But you know we're gonna support our own brand. Yes. Very important, family. So, family, everyone, uh, let me just make a quick announcement. 